Today we want to share how we fixed the unusual power seat issue on this 2002 Chevy Avalanche. Usually if a power seat doesn't work, check fuse or relay switch. On this Avalanche it can be found under the passenger side dash by the emergency brake pedal. After testing the ohms, it checked out okay. Then before checking the wiring, we go to the switches. And this is where it got interesting. We have the switch panel unscrewed to check the harness plug to the switch. And noticed there's two separate switch boxes. The long one with two switches that operate the seat and the back, which are not working. And the small switch box for the lumbar, which works just fine. So we continue to trace the wires under the seat going to the motors. This is when we notice some cracked plastic on the floor under the seat. When we put a flashlight to see where this plastic cover came from, we noticed the box with a circuit board with no cover. And this wire plug was just hanging unplugged. It appears the crack cover we found came from the top of the box. After some research online, we found out this box is a power seat control module. After we plugged it back in, the two switches on the large box began working again. So before changing the switch box, you may want to check this plug on the module. We also found out how the cover cracked and got unplugged. My son remembers placing his knee on the seat while reaching for something on the passenger side and he heard something cracking. And a few days later, he discovered the switches were not working. Keep in mind that this seat is 20 years old, so the padding is not what it used to be and the springs are probably stretched a little bit. We're planning to redo the upholstery when we're done with all the mechanical projects to this vehicle. Before we put back the four screws in the uh, switch panel, we check one more time. Well, thank you for watching. I hope this video helped you along the way. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. See the description for links of tools and materials used in this video. And you all have a great day.